good morning everybody or good afternoon wherever you are i came out of retirement to share great news with all of you feather client is now a standalone fabric mod meaning anyone can use it in any launcher or at least they're beta testing and the, the owner might have like texted me and told me to like you know try it out so i'm gonna try it out i'll show you guys how to do it very easy very simple and let's get into it so the link is the website slash download slash fabric i'm pretty sure and what this is is it's basically turning feather client into its own standalone mod so i'm gonna do it in modern then i'm gonna do it in prism mc and show you guys how to work this client all right here in modern what you want to do is you want to create a new profile you want to make it fabric you want to name it whatever you want feather clients uh video and you can you know set it to fabric any version over 1.17 is what Braden told me so let's just do 1.20 um advanced just yeah okay yeah. so basically fabric any version of 1.17 i remember and create so here it's creating the profile that we'd be using i i don't know if there's an easier way but this is the easy way so it's easy way so you want to go to folder and here in mods you want to take your feather client standalone mod just like this and you want to x and now you can see it here feather standalone jar now i'm pretty sure you need to download the fabric api so let's add that right here fabric api so the client can work you can go back and now we have the fabric api and the feather client now all to do is press play and let the magic happen baby okay so here we are inside of feather client this is what it looks like 1.20 feather so far it's it's good see we have social screenshots settings packs it might take some time to like load in some of the features but oh my god look at all this like all this inside of the client and we don't even have to like do any extra steps like before we had to like get the account json open a folder replace it restart our computer uh destroy our pc in the process but now it's a single standalone mod meaning that we just have to like just use the client like any other fabric mod let me just show you guys that this is the client so we have press shift like the right hand shift to open all the mod menus and you can go to settings and here you have all the mods this is the mod menu this client has a ton of mods like this is way more than what i remember holy but yeah voice chat everything there's everything here now i'm going to show you guys how to do it on poly mc prism mc all of those mc crack launchers all right so now we're going to do it with a crack launcher as you can tell like manage accounts look here offline all right offline account type offline it's ready let's do this so we're gonna add a, add, add an instance and here we're gonna go fabric whatever version you want 1.20 let's name it feather all right so newest version of fabric 1.20 uh we just press ok it's created now from here i'm not an expert but i'm pretty sure we have to edit the instance and go to mods and add a file i was correct and you do add a file and add the jar so from here we can go we can either launch it right now or close so i'm gonna try to close it 
And now we're gonna launch it with our craft account. All right, I'll come back to you guys when this is done. All right, so another thing I missed was to get Fabric API because once again, this is a standalone Fabric API mod. So what I did, I came to CurseForge and you do the same. You make sure you do the same. Put in the version that you're running download the file from here download file and then in your little launcher edit your instance and add the API now we can play feather client on cracked look at this build the offer on feather client and look at this same thing complex what is this failed to invalid session oh that's because i think we're on crack so let's go on the crack server like jar text network dot net what, what's what's a what, no, blocks mc dot com And yep, we can join crack servers. That's amazing. So fill the offer, fill the offer. I did that. Okay. Fill the offer, fill. I might be like slow. But here we are, we're inside. And just like that, we also have feather settings. Feather settings, we also have, look at everything on the screen. Look at all, take it in guys. Take it in because this is legit. This is legit. Legit. Legit, legit, see, see? See, fill the offer. I wanna thank Brayden for reaching out to me and sharing his new project with me uh join the discord server for updates and also if you want to try this out and you find any bugs you can tell brendan in his server he has his own dedicated channel to this project please leave a like and subscribe i'll see you guys in the next one thank you for the client